Ever since a winter storm bombarded the capital region with rain, snow, and ice, leaving thousands without power. We're going to take a live look right now at National Grid's power outage map. Many of the outages are in Saratoga County, Warren County, and further north. As you can see, there are still a lot of people waiting in the dark. The company says they've had about 140,000 customers impacted across eastern New York. CBS 6's Brianna Sapardi was out with crews today and tells us when the majority of customers will be restored. Powerless. That's how thousands were left after Friday's winter storm moved across New York, and many are still waiting for it to get restored. Last 24 hours have been particularly challenging to our crews. Yesterday, uh, the capital region and areas north got hit with uh, a quarter to upwards of a half an inch of ice due to freezing rain, followed by snow and wind gusts of up to 50 miles per hour. We've had uh, upwards of 140,000 customers impacted here in eastern New York. At its peak, we had 96,000 interrupted at one time. Diocese says the buildup of snow, sleet, and ice on tree limbs and wires were just too much weight for them to handle. In terms of outages, he says this has been the worst storm this season. Among the hardest hit areas were Saratoga, Warren, Essex, and Washington counties. Wilton resident Kenny Davis says he was without power for 32 hours. We barely survived. <laughs> no, actually, it's not us. Like, we're good. It's the cats. So the house gets so cold that we feel bad for the cats. After losing power yesterday morning, it finally came back on late this afternoon. It's like amazing. It's like, a, it's like it's the first time I've ever had power. But thousands haven't been so lucky. Diocese says crews have been working 18-hour shifts around the clock to get the power back on. We're hoping to have the greatest majority of our customers restored by midnight tonight and then continue uh, to work tomorrow with the goal of having all customers restored by midnight Sunday night. Reporting in Saratoga, Brianna Supardi, CBS 6 News. Spectrum Cable and Internet